Hi, I'm Kevin, the creator of WPE Signature by Approve Me. I hope that you'll find our signature plugin a fantastic fit for your company. What would you do if you found out that the contracts you used to run and operate your business were not legally binding? Think about all the hard work you invested into a recent project or a client relationship. What happens if you and your client were in a courtroom only to find out that the digital signature used on your contract was not signed with the compliant e-signature application? Form generation WordPress plugins like Gravity Forms, Ninja Forms, and many others are absolutely fantastic. However, signing a legally binding court-recognized contract is not their main focus. It is, however, WPE Signature's entire focus. The new signature add-on by Approve Me is the UETA eSign compliant answer for your WordPress form plugins and powerful contract workflows. The document signing experience is built exclusively into your WordPress website. In the next few minutes, you'll learn how to protect your clients and yourself with a legally binding court-recognized contract that gets automatically generated when your form is submitted. In order to automate the contract creation process, we'll need the following plugins installed. Contact Form 7, WP eSignature by Approve Me, the eSignature Advanced Features Pack, and of course the Contact Form 7 signature add-on by Approve Me. Once these plugins are installed and your Approve Me business license is validated, you'll need to create a blank WordPress page. There's no need to add any content to this page. We'll only need to add a title so we can find it later. Next, we navigate to the Add New Document link, which can be found under the eSignature option in the WordPress dashboard. For this add-on, we'll need to create a standalone document. Let's give our standalone document a name. In this case, we're going to call our document Web Design Proposal. This next step will vary based on your desired outcome. The Contact Form 7 signature add-on by Approve Me is triggered whenever a form that you select is completed. This means that you can also pass user data from the form into a new contract that will either be emailed to the user or displayed immediately after they submit your form. With the Custom Fields add-on enabled, you will navigate to the Custom Fields icon and choose the option Contact Form 7 Data. Go ahead and select the form that will trigger this contract from the drop-down menu. Now select the field data that you would like to insert into your new contract. A short code will automatically be generated with this information. Don't worry though, the actual field value that your user enters when filling out your form will be displayed in its place once they are redirected to your contract. You can move the short code that gets generated anywhere in your contract and it will display the user's submitted data wherever you have the short code located in your contract. After choosing your desired document options below, you can publish your standalone document. Congratulations, we're now 50% complete with the automation process. Click Let's Go Now to define those last form settings. The next step is you'll need to navigate to the eSignature tab. Enter the field details for the signer's name and email. Choose to either redirect the user to your contract immediately or to send them an invitation email to the contract here. Signing reminder emails are a set of emails that will remind your signer to sign your contract if they have not done so by a specific date. In this example, we'll choose to remind our signers in 4 days, every 3 days, for the next 21 days until they sign our contract. And that's how easy it is to automatically collect a legally binding court-recognized contract using Contact Form 7 and Approve Me's WPE signature. If you have any questions, please email us at curious at approveme.com. We're real people and we would love to hear from you. Thank you for watching.